Hey, this is Brett, and this 2013 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 is stock number 14040Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used sports car headquarters. This 2013 Ford Mustang GT500 has the 5.8 liter supercharged V8 engine puts out 662 horsepower. This car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this car is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, start it up, take a look under the hood, give you the most accurate representation that I can of the car. Sterling gray metallic is the color. I shoot all my videos in 4K. And if you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash summit auto. Click the bell notifications. You'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and specifically sports car walkarounds on YouTube. This one comes with the 19 inch painted SVT wheels in the front. This is part of the SVT performance package. You get the Brembo brakes in the front as well. This one comes with Michelin Pilot Sport AS3 tires. These are 265 40 ZR19s in the front. And these tires, I would say, have probably about 70 to 80% of the tread left on them. Didn't see any scuffs or scrapes on that wheel. The uh, Cobra logo looks really good. Stripe is in nice condition, didn't see any dents or dings on that fender. Comes with the HID headlamps, the LED running lights, and the factory fog lights. I'm gonna turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. Front bumper and lower valence are absolutely perfect. No scuffs, no scrapes, no dents. Uh, it's never been drilled into as far as a license plate is concerned and the black center stripes all look really good. I didn't see any rock chips or anything on them. And the hood is in fantastic condition as well. Stripes are in really nice shape on the hood. No dents or dings on that hood. And the passenger side fender is in nice condition too. No dents or dings. Passenger side front wheel is in nice shape. And the only thing I'm going to note on this entire car is there is a very, very small scratch that's been touched up on the uh, passenger side front fender. But other than that, this car is very, very nice. I would say near mint condition. As you go down the passenger side of this car, take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away, or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the car, you can see the car, hear the car, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises, and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you. Very nice down that side. Not one single dent or ding. Back wheel. These are 20s in the back. We still have Michelin Pilot Sports back here. 285, 35 ZR20 tires. And uh, take a look at the tread pattern as well as how much tread's left. I would say very comparable to the front tires. And the underbody from what you can see is in really nice condition. This is extremely hard to do with the gimbal and uh, sterling gray metallic, one of my favorite colors on the Fords. It's got a lot of very fine metal flake to it. Really a good looking color, shimmers a lot. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, the rear bumper is absolutely perfect. No scuffs, no scrapes, very, very nice. The stripes are in fantastic condition as well. The uh, back plate here, no scratches or anything on that get the Shelby GT500 logo there. That looks good. And the stripes on the trunk lid are in very nice condition as well. You get the LED tail lamps on here. Take a look inside the trunk. Here is your cover for the uh, 
convertible top. You do get the Shaker Pro sound system in this one. And uh, underneath here is the tire inflator kit. These are always just really a pain to get out. There we go, there's your tire inflator kit. But um, very clean back here. Shocks are doing a nice job on that trunk lid. And I always like closing them from the top here so that you don't scratch up that plastic surround. It does have the factory exhaust on it going down the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side. No dents, no dings, no scuffs, no scrapes. Very, very nice. It does have a capless fuel fill. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is in excellent condition as well. No scuffs or scrapes on there. Down the rest of the side of the car, the door looks very, very good. The stripes are in excellent condition as well. Edge of the door looks really good. You get the power mirrors with the blind spot mirror. Inside, this one comes with the Recaro black on black leather and Alcantara suede seats. You get the Cobra stitched into the backrest. Side current airbags, you get the Recaro logo stitched into the side of the seat as well. Driver's seat height adjuster. These are manual seats, factory GT500 floor mats. You get launch control, you get your different uh, dampeners for your suspension and then your different steering feels. Auto headlamps, power windows, locks, and mirrors. Back seats, just as nice as the front seats. No rips or tears back there. Carpeting is very nice and clean. And we'll hop inside, check out the miles, radio, and everything this car has to offer on the interior. You can see that this one has 9,027 miles. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean. You get the suede and leather wrapped steering wheel. Bluetooth and audio controls on the right, cruise controls and information center controls on the left. Didn't see any rips or tears on that steering wheel. Looks really nice. So this one comes with my favorite radio on the Fords. It's the uh, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. Uh, it does come with the factory navigation system. There's Highway 41 and Rolling Meadows Drive. So that is working nicely. Uh, you get AM, FM, and Sirius, like I said. You also have a hard drive where you can download uh, music from CDs and everything into the jukebox, which is really cool. And uh, then you have your own music on here. And uh, really nice radio, easy to use. Down here, your climate controls, including your dual climate controls. You can see the ambient lighting on the floor there, um, part of the ambient lighting group. You can change those colors. It's in the cup holders too. Six speed manual transmission with the uh, cue ball shifter on there. Stability control, trunk popper, hazard lights. Um, from what I can see on this car, everything is definitely stock. I don't think it's been modified. We'll take a look under the hood. Uh, passenger seat, no rips or tears. The inside of the soft top is in nice condition. Home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems, map lights, and your soft top control. So I'm going to open up the soft top. There's one right there and one right there. And then just press that button. And away she goes. And it'll stop as soon as it's down all the way. And uh, we're going to start it up, take a look under the hood, check out all those LED and HID lights. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that other than my brake lights on. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. Hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the quality, condition, options, and of course cleanliness of this car all the way around, inside and out. The exhaust sounds really good. Really a sweet ride. These are getting harder and harder to find, especially with low miles and 
optioned out as nicely as this one. There are those HID headlamps, LED running lights, fog lights are working nicely. And under the hood, we have the 5.8 liter supercharged V8 engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change, all the fluids have been checked and topped off, and it is 100% ready to go. There is the emission sticker. And uh, like I said, I, I believe this car is bone stock. I don't think it's been modified at all. There is your hand-built badge. Anne LeMay and Chad Baca built this one, best I can tell. Anyways, really a sweet ride. And this car is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna do one more final walk around with the top down so you can get a good idea from all the angles. And I would highly recommend this car from a quality and condition standpoint. You definitely do not see as many come in as clean as this one. And uh, love that color too. And I would ship this one anywhere. And whoever's going to get it is going to be extremely happy with it. And to see more pictures of this car or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, sports cars, Mustangs, Camaros, Challengers, Chargers, Corvettes, GT500, Z06s, ZL1s, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notification so you get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds and sports car walkarounds on YouTube, over 8,000 videos and counting. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more GT500 cars I've done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2013 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 in sterling gray metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.